This is Agate Springs, 20 million years ago, the beginning of the Miocene epoch. This savanna will one day become the badlands of Nebraska. Not long ago, these plains were lush and heavily forested, nurtured by volcanic ash spread by wind and rain. But as the global climate begins to shift, conditions are becoming increasingly arid. This brings hardship for the native fauna. It's now the peak of the dry season and a small group of Stenomylus gather around what remains of a rapidly shrinking watering hole. Despite appearing similar to antelope, the lanky herbivores are actually an early form of camel. These relict puddles provide a lifeline for all manner of animals. This also makes them an ideal hunting ground for predators. Deodon, one of the few animals that benefits from the harsh conditions of the dry spell. This individual is a young male, only having recently left the care of his mother. But he's already a formidable hunter. Weakened from the heat and focused on water, the Stenomylus should be easy prey. If he can catch one, that is. It seems even a weakened camel can outrun a deodon in a straight chase. Only one out of every ten hunts is likely to be successful. His hunger will drive him to try again, and an animal of his size must feed soon. <laughs> 